He said, uh, you need to start chemotherapy immediately. Really? Uh, and uh, yeah, your football career might be over. I'm, whoa, you know what I mean? Like, whoa, you at 17, man? At 17, when, you know, that's, that's that was my identity. Yeah, for that's sure. It. That was it. Like, yeah, I mean, you know, I ain't, I mean, it's ball. You know, that's all I know. All I know is ball, man, you know, um, and uh, having a chance to do what I wanted to do, my world was shook, man. I, I literally, it was signing day, I got the news, I started chemotherapy a week after signing day. Like I'm and I'm I'm in the hospital like shook, like still shocked. Um I remember the first the first doctor I went to, he told me that uh they was probably about to cut my leg off. Really? I, yeah, I'd never play ball again. That was the first opinion. That's why I always tell people get second opinions. All right, <laughs> yeah, yeah, no, yeah, yeah, that's why I don't yeah, man. I uh the first doctor I went to see, he said, Man, um, you know, uh normally because I had an osteosarcoma. So normally uh, the sarcomas, the, especially that one, is towards the knee. So most people need to get full knee replacements, right? So my first, my first sign of, first sign of God, I guess, in this, in in the midst of turmoil, my second opinion. So I I, uh, I took chemotherapy at uh, at UIC Hospital downtown Chicago. They referred me to Chicago Rush. So I go to Rush. And I, I walk in, this is a world-class doctor uh, named Steven Gattelis. Man, he got awards on the wall. This man, he the man. You know, he got plaques all. I'm walking in here, and I'm, you know, I'm like, man, I'm just waiting to see what he got to say. You know, and uh, man, he came in there, he pulled my x-ray up, and he said, because of the spot of your tumor, I'm not going to have to touch your knee. Uh, 